Ever seen two galaxy clusters T-bone each other at 4,500 kilometers per second? Welcome to this episode, JWS versus the Bullet Cluster. So, buckle up. Welcome to World Oversight. Make yourself comfortable, all right? In the left corner, Cluster A, that's one quadrillion suns, and trust me, it's got a bad attitude. In the right corner, Cluster B, a bit smaller, but it's packing hot gas, hotter than a million ovens. So what happens when these two titans collide? About 3.9 billion years ago, they smashed right into each other. The stars? They mostly missed. The space is surprisingly roomy. But the gas? Boom! It slammed together, heated up and screamed in X-rays. Enter the James Webb Space Telescope. Think of it as the universe's ultimate CSI. With its infrared vision, JWST spots billions of homeless stars, just drifting glitter. And it uses them to map invisible dark matter, shown in blue. Here's where it gets wild. JWS's map reveals a weird hammerhead clump of dark matter on the left side. Some scientists think our so-called winner already got into another cosmic bar fight before this one. Basically, in space, brawls have sequels. Why does any of this matter? Well, dark matter makes up 85% of all the stuff in the universe. By watching how it glides through wrecks like this, astronomers figure out just how ghostly it really is. Barely interacting, definitely on a cosmic diet. Every new measurement knocks another suspect off the dark matter lineup. So, next time you're stuck in traffic, remember, even galaxies can't find a decent collision speed. Smash that subscribe. No dark matter required. Et voilà, mes amis. Si monstre cosmique ne reste jamais en place, pero nosotros tampoco, la exploración sigue. So, no olvides dar like, suscribirte, et rester curieux pour plus de misteres interstellares. Remember, space never sits still and neither should you. Je suis quoi la prochaine aventure, mes amigos. Catch you beyond the...